If you've watched the overview of the Hermosa, we're going to dive into the details now of what really makes this special. And the Hermosa starts right here walking in. You're in a proper foyer, the right size, and it feels even larger than what you would expect in a 2,800 square foot home. As you come into the home, you realize this foyer space truly is separate, and then it comes into a separate little foyer that's leading upstairs with such an incredible, I saw this when we walked in, just this detail of a great spot for art and it really feels incredibly special. And that separates, again, where the great room would start. So an open concept done right still has separation to make each room stand on its own. There's three keys to a fantastic great room and the Hermosa has all three of them. Starts out with enormous space, enough for all the furniture and livability you want, Awesome spot for all the entertainment with an, just imagine that big TV on the wall, still viewable wherever you are in the kitchen or great room. The second though is making an open concept room still be private. This room is a room all on its own, even though we're completely open to the kitchen and dining. We're connected, but we're private. And then third is tons of natural light. Four huge windows on the back, spilling light in, along with windows on the side of the home. Additionally, we're bringing borrowed light in from the dining room that has two sides of light, as well as our foyer spilling light all the way down the hallway. So great size, great functionality, incredible light, and privacy, but still being open. That's the key to making a great room special. The kitchen is always blowing me away with the detail that goes in from our design team. Uh, I just love the functionality and the beauty. It starts with architectural details in the kitchen, and that is cabinetry that looks like it's fine furniture pushed into place, built in right to the ceiling, no dust catchers up at the top, solid end walls for the kitchen where cabinetry just ends properly and not hanging off to the side. The beauty of the backsplash, when we take the option and put the outlets up underneath the cabinetry, makes that backsplash one continuous beautiful piece. The cabinets themselves are incredible quality. We get them manufactured right here in North Carolina and slow closed doors, slow closed drawers that are dovetailed, but things that you need in your kitchen like that pull out trash with the trash and the recycling bin right there, right where you need it incredible kitchen sink. The beauty also when we're at this island and I'm looking out, who doesn't want to have a kitchen window when they're in their kitchen? How about three along with an eight foot door going straight into the outdoor covered outdoor living room and bringing the indoors and outdoors into one blended area? It's just so beautiful. The back wall though is one of the most special areas. And this is where I think so many designers just give an afterthought to putting in a refrigerator that's going to hang out in open space. Uh, we build one solid wall where that refrigerator will feel built in and then the cabinets themselves are so deep and so functional that you can have incredible storage and still have a walk-in pantry for all your, every, your other needs in that Costco purchases you might be doing. This wall is also incredibly functional with deep cabinets. Uh, if you're building a Hermosa, this is where the extra oven would go along with a microwave. So it's already prepared. We know what's going to happen. This little space here blows me away. And the reason I love it is it's that tucked away spot where you might have the prep appliances you need that you want to use and want to have out. Or entertaining wise, it's a great spot for cocktails and hors d'oeuvres to be placed. Into the kitchen is the next area and this is such a functional room. We've got a home management section right here, beautiful natural light spilling in, plenty of room for a big uh, desk area and I'm still connected to the home but I'm tucked away. I can do work, I can have my own spot, it might be a great place for kids to do homework. And then an enormous pantry right behind me and what, who has you know never enough space in your kitchen with a pantry so this is a fantastic location and just plenty of room. Again, real functional. This entire area that I'm standing in though can be done four different ways, just as we're showing it, or take this wall out and one huge home management area. It truly could be your own office. 
Additionally, we could put in butler's pantry or a full scullery with that extra sink and dishwasher you might want. Super functional space, just great use. We're up in the bonus room now, and what's so great about having this bonus room at the front of the house, it's right off the staircase coming up, makes a great adult entertainment room. You're not walking past kids' bedrooms or guest suites where you wouldn't naturally take your guests. It also is a fantastic place to have kids. As we walk up though and walk through, we have this wonderful little vestibule just greeting you as you come into the owner suite. I am just blown away when I walk in. I suddenly just kind of slow down because it's filled with so much light. Two sides of glass all the way around and not just one little window. It is filled with windows everywhere. And when we get back into the bedroom, we're seeing everything our architects are wanting us to see, but not what they don't. And it is the things that you don't want to see that are so important when you're in a bedroom trying to relax, trying to feel like it's that retreat. And what I'm talking about is looking at beautiful light and architecture, but not looking at bathrooms and not looking at closets and not looking at your bedroom door. It really is private and so kind of your own spot and you just feel like you're miles away from everything else. As we go into the owner's bath, you also come through another foyer, little vestibule, to bring you into this bathroom with the most gorgeous, feels like hand-painted tile and just an incredible layout. Huge vanity, oversized shower, separate commode. This is a room that just gives you all the functionality and again, that incredible quality, dovetail drawers, slow clothes, lots of space to put everything that you're going to have in here. Storage abounds. And then the closet itself, oversized with plenty of space for everything that you're going to want to store and make life easy.